Hi, this is Duncan. I uh, just wanted to really uh, produce a small video that really talked about rainwater harvesting here uh, in the UK. Uh, we're based about sort of 10 miles out of central London, a place called uh, West Wickham, uh, it's Bromley. It's just on the borders of London and Kent actually. Um, and one of the things that, uh, it's not really a big thing in the UK, but we did want to look at uh, doing some rainwater harvesting. When we had this office built, um, it's about 25 square meters. Uh, it's quite a big uh, footprint. Uh, it's relatively new as you can see, but when we bought the uh, building and had it built, um, it did come with a water butt. Uh, this one is a 100 liter uh, water butt, um, collecting the water off the roof. We just felt really uh, it wasn't big enough for what we wanted. Um, and after two rainfalls here in uh, London, uh, it was completely full. So what I did, I looked at the plans and we looked at investing in a rainwater harvesting system. So what I've ended up doing is getting three 1500 litre tanks. And these are coming off our roof now. Uh, this is this job's just been completed today. These are a German made uh, tank. So 1500 litres per tank. So we're at four and a half thousand litres collectively. Uh, really happy, very solid construction, as you can see. Uh, obviously man enough for the job. Uh, they're sitting on top of a foundation that I had poured, uh, so it's reinforced concrete and then I've just got some flagstones over the top uh, just to make it very tidy. Uh, what I've also done as well is connected each tank so it should be able to find its own level as we start to collect the rainwater. So again this has only really just been finished today. Uh, I'll just come round, you just get a slightly different view of the uh, water tanks. So really neat looking, uh, I'm happy that I went for the three tanks rather than one big tank. Uh, although it's not in view of the house, uh, I'd still wanted it to look really nice when it was finished. So if you come down you can see this is the make of the tank, uh, Spiedel, I suppose that might be uh, pronounced, uh, over from Germany. So really happy with the, uh, the end product, um, so these are obviously the access to the water tanks. And in particular, I wanted to just show you the uh, rainwater diverter. Uh, this is just a, a pipe. It's got a very slight fall going into the tank, but also when all three tanks fill, the water will come back to this pipe and then go down the drain and kick out here. Uh, but in particular, I think you might be interested in just looking at the uh, diverter. So you can see it's got open close. If I just turn this, um, so closed in this instance means that the water won't go into the tank uh, and it'll just go straight down to the drain. But when we switch it to open, uh, there's a filter built into the, uh, into the downpipe. So that'll filter out all the leaves, needles, seeds, etc. And then we've got nice clean water going into this uh, first tank. And then once, the, once it starts uh, filling up and once it's above about 10 centimeters off the ground, uh, it will go into the next tank and so on and so forth. So we should have a nice even uh, level of water. And then just as you come out to the far end, you can see there's a, a spigot, I suppose we would call that, uh, which has got a, a ball, uh, I think it's a ball valve. I'm not quite sure what you call that. You can see there, if I just try and turn it, you can see that's probably in the open position. Uh, we'll keep it close for now. Uh, I have got a, a water pump as well to be able to uh, to use the water. Uh, but very happy the way this has turned out. Uh, hopefully, you can see that uh, it's a nice clean finish. And it's just a bit of a shame that in the UK there's no subsidies for rainwater harvesting. So this unfortunately has been paid for by me. But uh, what it will do though is provide us with a lot of water. Uh, so we can use this to really water our garden um, and the grounds that we've got in the house. So really happy with, uh, with the finish. Um, if you don't have any questions though, uh, drop me a note. Um, there's been a few issues trying to put this together, uh, just making sure everything was watertight and we were efficiently collecting the water, but now it's all done. Uh, I'm very happy with what we've put together here. I did look at a first flush diverter uh, but I think actually this filter is more than fine for the job uh, seeing as we're only using the water for the garden. Uh, we are going to be putting a secondary rainwater harvesting system in to look after the house which we'll use for the 
uh, the toilets and for the washing machine. Okay, so this is uh, Duncan Kelman again. Thank you very much for uh, watching the video. Uh, hopefully you like it. If you've got any comments, feel free to drop me a note uh, and I'll respond to you when I can. Okay, thanks for watching the video. Bye for now.